All right, coming up next, a welterweight tilt between Bruce Lee and Robbie Lawler. Well, they just don't make fighters like this anymore. Here is the former UFC welterweight champion, ruthless Robbie Lawler. First UFC champion from American Top Team, still going strong in the UFC. Has such a crowd-pleasing style, it's no wonder why his fan base has continued to swell over the last several years. This guy has one-punch knockout power, and when a fighter has that kind of ability, it's always a big advantage. someone who can adapt to any style, and Bruce Lee himself certainly fits the bill. The founder of Jeet Kune Do and the man Dana White calls the father of modern mixed martial arts, he is perhaps the most influential martial artist of all time. As good a combination of speed, striking, unpredictability, and precision as we've ever had in martial arts, Good to see Bruce Lee making the UFC walk tonight. This guy is extremely well-rounded. His submissions are world-class. His striking is excellent. And he is extremely unpredictable in what attack he chooses to go with. Our tale of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. Lawler is four years the elder. He is four inches taller. He will have a two-inch reach advantage. All right, now for the official introductions, we go inside the Octagon where we find Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC walkaway division. It's a place fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 28 wins. 12 losses and one no contest. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Coconut Creek, Florida. Ruthless Robbie Lawler. And now we his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! Want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, come out fighting. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long right. time. And it is right. going to go down go right fight. now. Here we go. All right, so here is Robbie Lawler yet again, a pro since 2001. 20 of his 27 wins have come by way of knockout. We'll see if he can get the power game going here early tonight. Joe, how does he approach this particular challenge today? Robbie Lawler is one of the scariest strikers in the division, and one of his best weapons are his elbow techniques. Keep an eye out for them in this fight. Oh, this could be it! Lands a good combination. Oh, big kick to the head! Oh! Oh, he missed that kick. He 
Even when you block those, they'll still stun you. Good shot. Oh! This could be it right here. Just a slip there. He got tagged there. Lawler gets hit with a kick. That looked like it hurt you. Oh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by Lee. How about that chin? Just missed with a huge kick. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. Well, he got his head snapped back by that straight hand there, and he's shown a vulnerability tonight by leaning right into that punch as he tries to set up his own offense. He may want to focus on some defense here moving forward. Spinning back fist. Really missed with that Whoa. right hand. Oh, he's hurt! He's hurt! Can he hang on? knockout strike here for the victory. Well, Joe, you knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. Let's take a look at that again. Take a look at this from a different angle. Bang. So a strong candidate for some bonus money there. A huge knockout for him here tonight. Near perfect execution. They'll be talking about this result for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mugliotta has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 39 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Ruth the Dragon. Well, what else can you say about Bruce Lee after a performance like this one? Seemingly everyone on the roster wants to take their cracks against one of the founding fathers of mixed martial arts. And candidly, thus far, few men have succeeded. This just might have been Bruce Lee's best performance inside the octagon.